how's it going guys RNG Life here and today we're jumping into ranked once again and this time we're trying out that new boy Gigantus or Gigantus means giant titan whatever you want to call him uh, but this this guy is, is, is pretty big though uh, but basically we're trying out a full-on uh, rock Gemini kind of control deck and it's it's pretty cheeky I have to say I really like some of the plays this deck uh, does um, I modified my piece of golem deck, which is where we try to fuse our uh, big piece golem, mid piece golem, and stuff like that. Uh, I, I took out the piece golems, and I went ahead and added a few other options. I went ahead and went full Gemini, and I honestly like it a little bit more. I don't know why. Um, well, basically because Geminis are a lot more viable, and they have a lot more options to go into fusions. Uh, aside from that, and also the rock support makes this deck really good. Alright, so... We're basically running two copies of our boy Gigantus over here. You, I could run three. I, tr I, I tried it, but I feel like he clogs because he cannot be normal summoned. So if you draw him early and you don't really want to summon what you what you have in hand, uh, he's not the best thing to have. Like he, I, that's why I, at two I think he's fine. Uh, we are running a thirty card deck because you gotta you gotta go with that grass looks greener rock memes. It, it is so good. Um, I use a, a deck similar to this on stream. And I was wrecking for a while. <laughs> I don't know. I don't remember if I ever made a highlight video of it. But yeah, it, it was it was pretty pretty busted. Uh, but whatever. Today, we got two copies of our boy Gaia Plate, the Earth Giant, who's a really amazing boss monster in this deck. Like the fact that you can banish a lot of these guys, it's just it's really 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 good. Uh, so you banish rocks, and then we do have one card in the deck that benefits from all of our banished rocks. So keep an eye out for that. Uh, we also got three copies of Kuakimaru Sandman. Uh, I like, I really, really like this guy because he has the ability that you can just swarm the board with big beaters. Uh, and, and when you have him on the field, you can attack. They activate a wall of D, mirror walls, any anything they want to activate, any trap, um, except a counter trap, obviously. He can actually chain his effect and tribute and tribute himself to get rid of that card. It basically negates that uh, that trap. So it's really really beautiful. It's, it's like an amazing effect. Uh, one of the one of the best cards in this deck I have to say is that Sandman. And then one copy of Lost Guardian. This is a gate uh, not gate guardian. This is a uh, Paradox Bros. Uh, I think level up card and. Lost Guardian, pretty cool, I have to say. The original defense of this guy becomes the number of banished rock type monsters times 700. Now, the thing is, in this in this deck, we can banish rocks like crazy. I've had games where I've had like six, eight banished rock monsters, and multiplied by his multiplier, that's huge. Uh, so you can have him in defense just stalling for you they're not going to be able to get over him and this is going to let you draw into all your pieces um because well and also the fact that you can search him straight from the deck with that uh doki doki and you can put it face down which is hilarious because he if, if they don't read this card he comes out with zero it shows him at zero so they attack into him and he, bam he's like five six thousand he's, he's insanely huge uh so pretty good little trap there Two copies of Gem Knight Alexandrite. Uh, we're, we're actually going with the Gem Knight engine. So Alexandrite, I like him because he can he contribute himself to summon uh, one of these Gem Knight Lapis, which we're running at three. Uh, he can pretty much summon her. But the thing is, another rock in the grave equals more support for Triamid Pulse. Uh, three copies of Doki Doki because it's an amazing card. Uh, lets you pretty much search most things in the deck, which is awesome. And uh, put them straight on the field. So Doki Doki is really really good. Three copies of Lazuli because she gets you a lot of uh, Gem Knight plays. Uh, really good uh three copies of kuakimaru boulder this guy is your searcher for sandman if you ha haven't searched it with doki doki so boulder is going to get you that sandman early in, in the game so not bad and two copies of gem knight fusion uh this is just so we can pull off all of our fusion cards uh pretty much a card that's really good is zirconia uh, i'm not gonna lie this is this is just a good beater in the deck he comes out 2900 just beats down uh you can fuse him with any rock monster plus a gemini so or plus a, a gem knight i mean uh so that it's 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 interesting it's really interesting uh obviously you do have your place we can go into lapis and then try to fuse again into uh lady brilliant diamond and then all the all the effects where you summon a master diamond you can do that but it's a little bit more situational because you're not going full on gem knight but whatever that's pretty much it. Uh, as for other cards you can run, you can try running some other rock type cards. Uh, it, it just depends on what you have and what you want to try. Let's go ahead and just jump right in and let's see how we do today. All right. 
Who's first? Let's see if we can get lucky with this deck. Gold rank 5, Japanese player. This guy's gonna be trying hard. Actually, I, I like it when my opponents try hard in gold because, I don't know, I, I don't like beating down on the noobs. It just feels like, oh, great. Yeah, I really proved that this deck is good because it beat up a noob. It's like, nah, dude, I like it when they actually try and use an interesting deck. Alright, 30 card, 30 card players. No, dude, this is why it's dangerous to run 30 card decks. Um, so right off the bat, I'm keeping this hand. I might have drawn grass, which sucks. But I'm getting an extra draw next turn, so I can potentially pull off a fusion. I have Doki, which can get me a Gaia Plate straight from the deck, which is amazing. And we have we have potentially some plays here. So let's see what we draw. Come on. Not bad. Alright, so right off the bat, I think one of my best moves. Ooh, I have I oh, did I just did I just draw into the nuts, dude? Obviously, I can't use grass. Unfortunate. If this was a normal duel with a 20-card opponent, uh, yeah, I would have gone off on him, dude. But right now, I can still kind of go off, which is kind of funny. Uh, so let's do this. Let's normal summon. All right, and I am using Akiza with restart just because I'm I'm actually trying to farm for skills with Akiza. Uh, but let's send away Gaia Plate. Oh, to summon another Gaia Plate. Wow, look at this big boy. Look at this big boy. And then on top of that, Gem Knight Fusion. Oh my goodness, the first game. Told you Zirconia is good. Uh, so now we get to use the not wanted cards. So bam, and now we have resources to banish for uh, Earth, or uh, Earth Giant. Uh, so that's not bad at all. Uh, grass, I'm gonna go ahead and set it just to make him think I have something even though I have two big beaters. What are you, what are you gonna do to me? Uh, but let's go ahead and battle. I'll deal 28. Let's see the uh, wall of D is walls of D. Yeah, it's always a wall of D. Uh, oh, a Gardner. Okay. I'll hit your Gardner. Ooh. Fair enough, dude. Uh, but to be fair, um, Gaia Plate does cut them in half. Uh, which he did to Gardner, and that's what saved me from taking some crazy damage. I only took 100, and he took 200, so good congratulations, dude. Uh, or did he? No, he, no, no, they were playing at, uh, at 5,000, I believe, so they took, what, 12? Yeah, not bad. So they're, they're actually playing in defense. All right, let's draw. Lapis, actually. Uh, yes, activate his effect. Let's go ahead and banish the Doki. And now, I'm going to go ahead and, and recycle. My Gem Knight Fusion. So this makes me banish this bad boy. Give me that card back. Now I'm going to pull off another Fusion because I can. Just because I can. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and Special Summon. Ooh, I can go into her. That would be a, a little bit more interesting, actually. Yeah, let's go into her. So we're going to use a Zirconia and her. Because I don't like having weak boys on the field. So let's go ahead and make this uh this strong uh, like Lolly. Japanese rock style monster. Whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and use her effect though. All right, which is to burn. We're gonna basically deal a thousand damage. Also, the fact that we can send Lazuli and that also recovers a card. So, ooh, take a thousand. Gimme, gimme. Dude, I I love the Gem Knight engine. I I really do. Uh, so now we can pretty much. Uh, ooh, what else can we do? What else can we do? Ooh, can we can we still? Oh, we can we can pull off plays for days. <laughs> Ooh, you gotta be kidding me. All right, so right now I can banish Zirconia, but do I want to? Nah, not really. I'm gonna get rid of uh, Lazuli so I can recover that. And if I really want to, I can fuse away Gaia Plate. You know what? You know what? We're going all out this game. We're going all out this game. We're gonna fuse this guy and this girl. Oh, yeah. Get on out here, boy. Get on out here, big boys. All right, look at these gem knights, dude. Oh, this is actually pretty, pretty amazing. All right, let's battle. Alright, 24. Oh, it's a squirmer. That's a squirmer right there. Okay, rip that guy. Fair enough. Pretty good. Alright, I, I think I know what deck you're playing. You're, you're, you have all the annoying defense position monsters that either like deal damage, destroy. Wow, but the, the good thing is I can burn every turn. <laughs> but there we go. Trium and Pulse is going to be very, very essential. Uh, I don't really need to recover my, my stuff anymore. Uh, but let's go ahead and activate her effect. I'm going to basically send away. Hold on, hold on. Where are you? I'm going to send you away. I want to recover more things. Lazuli, do your thing. Gimme, gimme. All right. And my life points are still full, so that's that's pretty nice. Um, now, I think I might as well... I might as well banish her. 
Because I, I forget, you send away Lazuli every time. So that's pretty good. Now I'm going to go ahead and summon Lapis. And that's pretty good. I What I'm going to do right now is I know, I, pr I pretty much know I don't have lethal because your deck is this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit with the big one. And this is going to either force you to destroy the little one or whatever else. But let's see. Ooh, get wrecked. Cypher, okay. Take that damage, though. Uh, and then next turn, we can deal probably another 1,000 burn. And then on top of that, we'll see what else. But wow, you're actually running You're running an annoying defense deck. That's what you're trying to run. Uh, my card over here can only destroy face-ups, I think. Yeah, face-up card on the field and destroy. Um, your deck is un unfortunately really obnoxious. And then we got another one. Wow. So the thing is, like, I have I have some shenanigans here. So right off the bat, let's go ahead and uh, Lazuli it up. Uh, yep, Lapis Lazuli. I mean. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and use our effect, and I'm gonna I'm gonna de burn for 500 right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and send you away. All right. So burn for 500. So we're gonna go ahead and fight. I'm gonna I'm gonna hit with the with the 24. All right, best get out of my way. All right, so effect of man eater bug has to destroy the little one. <laughs> we control in the board and then try him in pulse. Give me that W, boy. Give me that W. Revive a rock. So what am I gonna banish? I'm gonna banish you, and uh, you. <laughs> and now we get to revive an, a Gaia plate for free in defense, which is annoying. I keep forgetting it revives it in defense. I keep forgetting. I actually could have gotten the burn. I, I legit forgot right there. That, that one's on me. <laughs> Rip, dude. I, I always forget it says in defense position, uh, which is unfortunate. Even though all they're playing is defense popping cards. Like, all they're doing is, is destroying my stuff. Uh, so, there we go. All right. Gaia Plate. Sure. Pay his cost. I forgot how he works, which is really, really unfortunate. Uh, let's banish one of these rock boys. Uh, now he's in attack position, though. We got special summon. We got both of them special summon. I, I doesn't matter. I win. You know what? And just to burn him even more. Just to burn even harder. Let's see. No, I can't. No. I was about to get him. Oh, you got to be kidding me. All right, I done goofed on that one. I completely forgot. I only had two banishable monsters. So rip, rip. I could have burned for a thousand. You have to be kidding me, dude. You have to be memeing me. All right, fair enough, dude. Ah, I'm so tilted by my own stupid plays. Wow, I'm so terrible. I'm, but whatever, we still win though. But oh my goodness, I need to work on the on the deck. I didn't see. Well, you gotta be careful with treatment pulls. <laughs> Shut up, Akiza. <laughs> Shut up with your friend talk, dude. I'm talking about treatment pulse right now. Uh, let's see what we got. Ooh, this is an interesting hand. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right. And I'm going second, so I'm gonna get to beat down. So once again, oh, wait. Does he have balance? No, he doesn't. He doesn't have balance heroes. Hmm. So he's got two of these guys out already. Oh, you're running that guy? Oh, okay then. Oh, okay. Interesting. I mean, noobs are not. When they're running a good deck, they're running a good deck. Or at least parts of a good deck. How strong can that thing get? It can get 2, 4, probably about 600 points stronger. So that's fine. Oh, we got Gigantes over here, dude. Alright, so I think we can do a little bit of shenanigans here. Obviously, set that tree in. Uh, it's such a good card. Uh, and I think I'm going to go full on. Yeah, I think I'm going to go all out right now. For the most part. Uh oh, what do you have? Oh, you have this guy's effect. That's the only thing you can chain. So if you want, you can send a thing away. And I forget what else you do. I'm pretty sure you only become 600 points stronger right now. Because he's got two in the grave. He'll add another one. That'll be six. Uh, effective Doki. <laughs> Let's get this boy in the grave, dude. Oh, you know what that means. You know what that means. That's a Gaia Plate straight from the deck once again, dude. Oh my goodness. I might have cut out some games. I'm not sure which ones made it in. But I've summoned this guy with Doki Doki quite a few times already. And and to top it off, we can go Gigantes. <laughs> Just because. Um, and I'm pretty sure you're going you're gonna to kill something. So I, I might be able to pay for uh, Gaia Plate's effect next turn. Uh, but there we go. We got that banished. So let's go ahead and enter battle. All right. So no matter what you have, you're gonna get cut in half. It's not gonna be enough. Whatever you, whatever power up you have, it's not gonna be enough. Damage step if you want. 
Dream? Ah, that's what it was. What I was forgetting. All right, I forgot Dreamer. Okay, not bad, not bad. What? What do you have, dude? I mean, if I attack right now, I'm gonna take like two thousand in the face. But I think I might have to. I'm gonna have to right now. Okay, I'll take the fifteen. Awesome. I'm glad. I'm just glad he didn't uh, use his effect to power up. Uh, but rip, dude! I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. Dreamer is a thing. So now I can at least pay for a Gaia plate. That's the whole reason why I sent away Doki Doki, uh, because in in which case, if he just switches to defense and does not attack me, at least now I have a, a way to bounce back. Tribute to the Doom, though. Okay. Um. Okay. Fair enough. You know now I can pay for a trim impulse, though, right? You know I can do that now, right? Um, and I'm actually kind of down for you to kill it, though, but... How strong is your defense? Like, really bad? Yeah, your defense is, like, really bad. So, I could revive a Gaia Plate, but I... Mm. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna straight up do this. I'm gonna use the effect, banish... And I'm gonna pop. Instead of reviving anything, because I can't revive, obviously. Um, because once this guy dies, I get all my stuff wrecked. So... Yeah, I didn't want to lose my Trim Impulse. That's basically the reason. Uh, so now... Ooh, ooh, ooh. You can't use traps on me. You, I have 19 and 19 for the most part. And, yeah, it's looking pretty dangerous for you, dude. Because I got these boys. Alright. Take some damage. Hope it was worth it. But yeah, this is a nice quick game to show off what this deck can do. Uh, now we reveal. all Pretty much everything in the deck is rock, so we just reveal any monster and we're good. Uh, so the only cost to having Sandman is you have to reveal a rock in hand. Uh, so any other monster. So what, what do you got for me? What do you got for me, Asta? We cannot use Trim Impulse right now, which is unfortunate. And he just quit. He just quit. He's like, nah, man, I can't win this game. Let's send him a nice. <laughs> Get nice, dude. Get nice. Trick up the sleeve. Arcana. I mean, they always use it. They always use Trick up the sleeve. Yeah. Why would you use Arcana or Arcana if you don't have that? And oh my goodness, I finally got a really good hand. <laughs> Ah, oh, but I'm going first. That's unfortunate. But grass looks greener. Give me that mill, boy. Oof. Oof. Oof, indeed. All right, so there's some uh, rock girls. All right, there's little lollies. I milled both of them. But that doesn't really matter too much. I'm going to set this first. I'm going to go for the doke. I'm going to go for the doke right now. Because my early move, my best play is honestly going to be wreck that... Uh, Cosmo Brain as soon as it hits the field. I can probably go for another Alexandrite to be fair, to be honest. Uh, because I can use his effect to, to recover a Lolly. So, we, we, we're good. Let's get him out. 1800 beater, not bad. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and use this because I, I might as well, I might as well use it. So, Fusion, sending away you to recover it. I can already pull off a Fusion, but am I gonna? Six in the grave. I can make, I can make it eight or nine. I'm gonna make it nine. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna make it nine right now. So, he, here's how I'm playing it. We're going all out with this hand on the first turn. Uh, we're gonna get that glossy boy out. So get that one and this one. All right, and we got zirconia. So all of that to get a 2,900 beater on board. Now we're gonna end. So now, as soon as you want to summon your Cosmo Brain, I am all set, dude. Summon that Cosmo Brain, and I will wreck you. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. So right now, I'm super ready for Cosmo Brain. So get on out here. Oh, the defense. What? Do you not have a Blue Eyes? Cyclone. Ooh, can we Can we even... You know what? I'm going to have to use this once. I'm going to have to use this once. Uh, it's popped. It's popped, dude. But we're going to revive. So if I revive... Ooh, who can I revive? I mean, I want to revive this boy. He, he's so good. So I'm going to banish... And let's banish non gem knight stuff right now. So, like you, um, I don't need you right now in the grave to revive a uh, guy plate in defense because you've already su uh, set, so you can't do anything about it. Uh, so I got I got a defense boy right now, so you can pop it if you want. But hey, we we got the cost for it. We we paid for it. We're good. We have a guy plate. So hey man, GG. My turn draw, and I have pays for days with this guy. 
So we, we can keep banishing if we want. And eventually, may, maybe I can get rid of uh, enough cards, banish enough cards to make Lost uh, Guardian be really, really cool. All right, so there's that. Let's go ahead and... Uh, ooh, I can recover one of these too. I could, but I won't. Just battle. Whatever it is, it's dead. Yep, it's dead. So now... Oh, now they're going to have Whitestone. And... Mm, now I don't have a way to protect. Rip. All right. That's really, really unfortunate. I really needed Trimid Pulse just to handle their their blue eyes. So now they can have a. I mean, I can kill whatever they have with Gaia Play. I can I can battle kill everything, but they can still potentially wreck me with the card effect. I I don't know. But I'm honestly expecting a Cosmo Brain. I really am. There is the Cosmo Brain. All right, so Cosmo Brain is finally making it out. Thirty one, pretty strong. So, what do you got with that Cosmo Brain? Okay, Silver's Crying. Alright, so they are gonna swarm like crazy. Which is unfortunate, because they can... Well, they can they can try to fight me. But, um, this guy doesn't really... Uh, hold on, is it only when he fights? Stand by. Oh, that, that's a dead guy. Battles. Oh yeah, you're dead, dude. <laughs> you idiot! Did you not read my card? I was reading it right now. I was making sure that I was trying... I wasn't... I had my bases covered. Uh, rip, dude. I can't stop here. I can't stop here, dude. That was pretty good. <laughs> but you know what? I think we are stopping here. So, GG. Alright, and in conclusion, uh, I think this is a nice uh, meme deck. I, re I really love Gaia Play. It's, it's just, it, it wins games, dude. It wins games. Uh, but yeah, on that on that last game, it was my opponent's my opponent's own stupidity and, and, and lack of knowledge that won me the game because you, you never attack into a guy play. Uh, but so that was that was interesting. So that's pretty much the deck. It's a pretty interesting deck. It lets you do a whole bunch of fusion plays, a whole bunch of like special summoning. It's really really cheeky. Uh, I really enjoy it. Uh, but that's pretty much that deck. And I, I guess if you have all the pieces. But the thing is, it's so interchangeable because it's just rock monsters. You can run pretty much any rock monsters in this deck, and it, it'll still probably work. You'll just have options for different things. It's like a toolbox deck. But whatever, that's pretty much it for today. Let me know what you guys thought of the deck. Let me know if you guys would run anything different. Uh, because I, I know I know this deck can be run in so many different ways. But whatever, that's pretty much it. And if you guys enjoyed, go ahead and leave a like, share, and subscribe for more dueling shenanigans. But anyway, thank you guys for watching today. Have a great day, and see you guys.